guys, Digital Legends has just released a new update for Respawnables, and this is called the, the Mexican Fiesta. So let's go inside this update and see what new items and prizes this gives. So first of all, you can see there's a colorful look on the loading screen, and now you can see there's a cool new background that has come with this update. Look at all the confetti that's falling down, it gives the game just a cheerful look. So let's go on to the actual um, event and you go on how to play, let's see. So first get ready for the party, equip yourself with the MX items and weapons. And I'm assuming that the MX stands for Mexican because of the name. Uh, check the prize tab to review your objectives and where do you have to achieve them. Win exclusive rewards and all prizes are free. And here are the tips. So. Uh, the head I think gives 50% damage to um, MX weapons There's dual re uh, freedom revolvers released 30% fast reload, 7% extra speed with the pants And the uh, jacket is the one that gives 30% fast reload to MX weapons And 17 days left And it says this is not over yet So you can use your MX weapons to kill 10 enemies in a row And if you are equipped with MX items you can get free gold So I'm not near the end yet so I haven't found out what this means so when I get to that I'll release that for sure let's head on into this now so you can see there's black churro gear and MX pack and those are the new bundles that are released black churro gear is this gives dual freedom revolver which just has these stats everything maxed except damage accuracy and agility are missing one Black Shore Mask increased 50% damage will caused by MX weapons, 7% agility given to Black Shore Jacket, MX weapons will reload 30% faster, this also gives agility, run 7% faster while ca carrying MX weapons, and this gives 10% health. Let's go into the MX pack now. Rudo Wrestler Mask gets 15 extra protection from MX weapons, 10% health. Veteran Technico Mask gives 15% damage caused by MX weapons. 7% agility, okay. Veteran Rudo Mask gives 25% extra protection against MX weapons and 10% health. And finally, the Armed Guitar Case, which has everything three bars except for agility, which has two. Now, let's look at this one. The Mexico jersey is back, and this used to be uh, out in the update where it was FIFA, and now it's back because of the Mexico. Uh, Mexican Fiesta So here's the prizes Tier 1 is Technico Wrestler Mask You had to finish 4th or higher in a free for all match and you had to do that 2 times Tier 2 is Spotters um, Equip yourself with an MX weapon and kill 10 enemies and do this 3 times in a team versus match This one is pretty um, time consuming because you had to use Heavy Machine Gun or Armed Guitar Case So if you can't buy the Armed Guitar Case You're stuck with the Heavy Machine Gun So it's pretty unfair to people who can't buy it the Freedom Revolver is okay, it's um, not as good as a real revolver I'm pretty sure because I haven't seen many people just kill me with it in games. Uh, and Medikit, Ultra Grenade, Ruder Wrestler Mask, Stun Grenade, Veteran Technico Mask, Gold Reward, and this gives 25 gold. Spotters, Ballistic Knife, Veteran Ruder Mask, Cash Reward, Gold Reward again, and Rocket Guitar Case finally. This has 4 damage, two, 3 range, 2 accuracy, and 1 agility. And it's sort of like a half upside down pyramid. I think this is the first weapon to do that with the stats like that. And uh, I think they should remove all this garbage like spotters and stuff in the thing. But in on the other hand, there's noobs that don't really have that stuff. But I'm sure pros already have enough spotters and don't well, like waste their time on tiers that just give you spotters or other gadgets that they already have. And yeah, so that's it for today. And I hope you guys go into this and try to finish it as fast as possible. You have 17 days, so you have a whole lot of time. And I'm just going to be enjoying myself trying to finish the event. And trying to kill people with heavy machine gun. And my tips for that tier are use heavy machine gun, of course. Or you can use the guitar case. But um, I'd say use Ghostbuster fans because lots of people are using stun grenades. And use some anti-explosive gear also some agility like this techn technical wrestler mask so those are my tips guys also try to use stun grenades or immunity shields immunity shields are pretty good when you're going up against a strong 
um, opponent. Also, use stun grenades from the corner. Peek up from the corner, just throw a stun grenade. And remember, you can't stun yourself with these pants. So it's going to be a huge advantage to you. Thanks for watching, guys. That was Android right now. And I'll see you guys next time.